this section, in addition to solving inequalities, we're going to review set builder and interval notation. We see our first inequality here, and we want to isolate the variable on the left-hand side. So we will begin by subtracting 1 on each side. This will give us negative 8t on the left and 16 on the right. Whenever we multiply or divide each side of an inequality by a negative number, and in this case we're dividing by negative 8, we need to change the direction of the inequality. Here we are going to get t is now greater than negative 2. Graphing this on a number line, we will have an open circle at negative 2 with all the values to the right of it shaded. In set builder notation, let me write set builder, we have the set of all x's such that, and then we, this will be the set of all t's such that t is greater than negative 2. Remember that the bar represents the words such that. In interval notation, we would write this as the interval from negative 2 to positive infinity, and we would use parentheses on both ends because we do not include the negative 2, and infinity is not a number that can be equal to. In this next example, we have fractions, and so we are going to multiply through by the least common denominator of 12 to clear the fractions right off the bat. In the first fraction, the 12 cancels with the 4, leaving 3. So we have 3 times y plus 3, minus, and then the 12 cancels with the 6, leaving 2 times the 3y plus 1, which is in the numerator, is greater than negative 1. Negative 1 is what is left after the 12's cancel. Now we are going to do some distribution on the left-hand side of the equation. The left side becomes 3y plus 9 minus 6y minus 2, then greater than the negative 1. We will then combine like terms on the left side of the equation. This leaves us with negative 3y plus 7 is greater than negative 1. And then we subtract 7 on each side. This gives us negative 3y is greater than negative 8. Again, we are going to divide by a negative number on each side of the equation, which is going to have us change the direction of the inequality. We now have y is less than 8 thirds. And if we were to graph this on number line, we would have an open circle at 8 thirds with everything to the left of that shaded. And in interval notation, this is the interval from negative infinity to 8 thirds. And written in set builder notation, this would be the set of all y values such that y is less than 8 thirds.